Hi everyone, it's your Breathless Beauty again. I'm having a party. I'm going to have a crafting party. I invited some neighbors over and we're going to sit and do some crafts. I'll get to the crafts in a minute. But I wanted to show you something. So I got this Brother Cut and Scan SDX85. And I got it a little while ago and when I got it, it came with a free pattern. Actually quite a few. I really like this Cut and Scan. Um, it's easy to use their software and they're always giving you free product projects and stuff but this is what it came with it came with this cute little box right just a little box and it was basically this was basically to teach me how to load the mat and everything well I decided they're so adorable I'm going to make party favors for the party so I got this really great paper right it's called spice market and it is spice market from Ella and Vive Vive I don't know how to say it but anyway I'll, I'll put the link in in the description look at these paper isn't that great they're all different right so I cut some out here I'm gonna cut one more and these are going to be filled with some noms, like just a little Godiva candy. And look at these. Again, I'll put the link. These are just flowers. Isn't that fun? So the little flower seeds. And it's going to go along with the theme of the party, which is kind of spring and flowers and pretty colors. But anyway, I'm going to get started. I hope I'm not in your way. But I'm going to use, again, this is from the Spice Market packet I got. And as you can see, there's the, the name, however you say that. Ella Vive, Ella 14, I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to load it up. And grant you, I am a super newbie at this thing, but I mean, sheesh, if a newbie like me can do it, you can certainly do it. As you can tell, I already scrunched that up, learning all kinds of new things that I never thought. And then we're going to do the pattern that came with it. we got to load our mat. I like that it just loads itself. And then we're going to, we have to select that we want to cut the darn thing out. And we're going to start cutting. I'm not going to show you the whole cutting process. It takes a couple minutes. It's actually quite boring. So why it's cutting. I'm going to show you. Oh my God, there's dead space. You know what that means? Nothing. This is how it comes out. And we just fold it and fold it and fold it because you can see there's, uh, maybe you can't see, but there is uh, fold lines, like little perforations there. And then you take these two and you put them together and you take your, and they kind of, down. I'm afraid to do it on the thing why it's cutting. So it squishes. It's a little hard to get in, but it can be done. So there's one half, right? And there I'm going to put, so I got my candy. And my now I found that this in order to get it in there because it's kind of a big package I need to fold it up and then we just put the other side up on there like so
And isn't that an adorable little party favor? So it's almost done. I like how it does itself. It, it's kind of fun to watch, but maybe I'm just a nerd. And when it's done printing, it lets me know. It says it's one minute, but it's not always one minute. It's pretty quick, actually. Meaning, it is one minute, but that one minute, the countdown on it is pretty quick. And when it's all done cutting, it pops it out. I press OK. I pop it out. And then, that's what you're left with. Now, this brother came with some storage compartments, which is nice. I don't have much to store. And it did come with a stylus and a thing to pull it up with. And that's what you're left with. Ready to make a pretty. Next, I'll talk about... Um, the rest of the party and the favor, not the favors, because we just did the favors, right? But what we're actually going to do for our craft and the treats.